Hi, great that you're back. Today I'd like to show you a little um, comparison between the DJ Osmo Pocket 3 and the Insta360 Link camera. Um, I just hooked up the DJ Osmo Pocket 3 to my, to my PC and I was just blown away from the quality. Right now I have only one small light switched on at my um, at my table and the quality is so amazing and this camera the sound is coming directly from the DJI pocket I will not tweak anything except maybe um, increase a little bit the the decibel but um, you know it it follows me everywhere and it, it does an awesome job here you see it, it it has no problems to follow me and I can keep on talking and this is really great and um, so we will do the same thing with the DJI Pocket with the same lightning and you will be amazed how awesome this DJI Pocket is as a webcam. You can use it in, in Zoom uh, conferences in, in everything basically that has a um, yeah that has a that needs a webcam. I'm not sure though if it will uh, have a heating problem I'm not sure, but um, now, right now it's recorded in 1920 times 1080 and the internal microphone. So now I will switch to the link with the same conditions and we will see the difference then. But before we switch, I want to show you it is so easy to switch in, um, in the portrait mode. You simply flip the screen and now we're in portrait mode. Isn't that awesome? I mean, this is ridiculous. This is, this is so unbelievable. Uh, you can't do that with the Insta360 link. And, um, and, and I can just simply switch back to the, port, uh, to the landscape mode without any problems right like this. But now we switch over to the Insta360. So now we do the same thing with the Insta360 and the internal microphone of the Insta. Uh, I'm very curious how the two sounds of the microphones compare and how the quality compares, but I think the um, the webcam from the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 is much better. So let's see if the Insta follows me too. So this is not the problem. Um, and it's doing also a pretty good job, but uh, yeah, I don't know. How this all it's, it's kind of slow and it has problems and I think the the um, the footage looks a little bit now now it lost me hey Insta okay now it's not coming back so I have to lean over here to to finish this um, and I'm really curious how the difference is and but I think the DJI Osmo will will win this one. So that was the comparison. Now we're back to the DJI Pocket 3. Let me know in the comments what you think. I think both cameras did a pretty good job, but um, as soon as I stood up and walked around in the room and with that last light in the room, the Insta really struggled. Uh, I think the footage got really grainy. Microphone wise, they're both great, I think. Um, I mean, these are the internal microphones of these uh, little cameras and they're doing a really great job. But um, I do think the footage of the Insta, uh, of the Pocket 3 is much crispier, way sharper and everything. Um, but the downside is right now you can only record in HD. You cannot record in 4K, which you could with the Insta360. Um, I have to say I have both running over the NVIDIA software so that I get this blurry background. Um, this is not, uh, you cannot do it in the cameras um, natively. So I let that run over NVIDIA software. So both have the same settings. Both were set so standard. Both were recording in HD. So I think they're doing both a pretty good job, but you can see that the uh, Pocket 3 has the bigger sensor and this is huge difference in low light condition. So hope you like the little comparison. Give me a thumbs up and if you have questions, write them down in the comments. If you like it, 
give me a thumbs up and otherwise we see each other next time.